Hi everybody, we're gonna make some shelves for my son, he's gonna get a new cat, so this is the idea, this is where the cat will sleep, and this is a shelf in the middle, and this is a box on the top with two shelves on it, and he can use the top also as a shelf. So I needed uh, six pieces of uh, of uh, playwood in the same size and the same measurement I cut them it will be the bottom and the top of the first box the bottom and the top of the first second box and the sides of the second box the first box will be slices of wood so the cat can breathe and can get air inside so it will not be so hot on the cat inside so and there's this uh, space in the middle it will be like 10-15 centimeters just only to keep a book or something so it will be space in the middle of the two boxes okay now we put down put up together this the first uh, upper shelves and uh, it's uh, a box normal box with two shelves in it with one shelf in it so it will be divided in two it's uh, not that hard thing to do it's make a box and put a background on it and then put a shelf in the middle that's all it's very easy and then now I made the lower part here it is two pieces of, uh, of uh, plywood sheets and I put uh, 45 degrees two pieces of wood I cut them in 45 degrees just to give them a thick look and I put them all together glue them and finish now I'm gonna make this side will stay open this side will stay open but the back side will be closed and the sides will be just like strips of wood so the cat will not go out from the side but it gets air and cooling inside it will not be very warm inside and then I'm gonna make a six centimeter shelf inside here between the box and the other box to be a six centimeter shelf so he can put a book or a mobile or something in the middle so I'm gonna show you in the end how it will look I put uh, the two pieces over each other there is a six centimeter opening in here so if he need to put a book or a mobile or a laptop or iPad something and this is the first shelf and this is the second shelf and this is the place for the cat this is how it looks from the back Now it's finished, not 100% will finish, but the coloring is finished. My son have a dark theme in his room, black and gray and blue. So he asked me to make it black. So this is how it looks like. With, I used alcohol coloring. So it will give it a nice finish. Of course, I need to add the finishing oil on it to give it this shiny look. <clears throat> and I need to add it some small legs just to keep it above the floor. So this is what we're going to do now. It's a very easy <clears throat> shelves to put it on the floor in the room. It's not so hard, it's only four pieces of slices of uh, sheets and just four small legs. Now it's finished, ready. I added the legs. It's not uh, very high, but it's only legs to keep it high. And I put some finish on it. I didn't add it a finish that give it a very shiny look but I just give it a finish 
to make it and I have added this side on another color because my son's room have this color and the black one so I have added them from the both side and they are open from here and open from up here so what do you think guys and this is how it looks at the end next to the bed we put the light down here to charging and here he have two shelves and he have the top shelf I put on cables next to it attach it to it so it would be easy for him to charge and there is this switch over here that switch off and on the night light the thing is done